Jesus Christ sees people deeply. He sees individuals. Their needs. Weep not. And who they can become. Young man, I say unto thee, arise. Even in our busy lives, we can follow the example of Jesus and see individuals, their needs, their faith, their struggle, and who they can become. You too can pray for the Lord to open your eyes to see things you would not normally see. The more you understand your true identity and purpose soul deep, the more it will influence everything in your life. As I pray for the Lord to open my eyes to see things I might not normally see, <coughs> I often ask myself two questions and pay attention to the impressions that come. What am I doing that I should stop doing? And what am I not doing that I should start doing? Some time ago during the sacrament, I asked myself these questions and was surprised by the impression that came. Stop looking at your phone when you are waiting in lines. Looking at my phone in lines had become almost automatic. I found it a good time to multitask, catch up on email, look at headlines, or scroll through a social media feed. probably be out of here in about five minutes and then I can go get her. The next morning, I found myself waiting in a line at the store. I pulled out my phone and then remembered the impression I had received. I put my phone away and looked around. I see you have a cat. <laughs> I do. With the storm coming, I don't want to be caught without cat food. Oh, I don't blame you. Those pets are really important. They are, for a fact. You just have the one cat? Uh, I had two, and one of them went out the door, and, you know, they get in the road, and... Oh, I'm anyway, so sorry. Yes. They become part of the family. I have dogs, so I know what you mean. Oh, yeah. So, uh, I haven't told anybody this, but uh, today is my birthday. Today? It's your yep. birthday? Yep. Oh, my goodness. Well, happy birthday Thank to you. you. Thank you. Oh, I'm so glad I ran into you. I hope you have a great day. Thank you. You too. Nice <laughs> talking to you. You too. <laughs> Bye. Bye. With all of my heart, 
I do not want to be like those in the parable of the Good Samaritan, those who see a need but then pass by. But too often, I think I am. I witness that Jesus Christ loves us and can give us eyes to see. Even when it's hard, even when we're tired, even when we're lonely, and even when the outcomes are not as we hoped. Through His grace, He will bless us and increase our capacity. Through the power of the Holy Ghost, Christ will enable us to see ourselves and see others as He does. With His help, we can discern what is most needful. We can begin to see the hand of the Lord working in and through the ordinary details of our lives. We will see deeply.